The thesis of my book, Being as Communion, is that the fundamental stuff of the world is information, that things are real because they exchange information one with another. The subtitle is A Metaphysics of Information, and so what I'm trying to do in this book is develop the idea that information is the primary stuff of the world. You know, and I think uh, this is really comes smack into uh, the materialistic worldview, which is what I think what we face largely uh, these days, which is that matter is the, the fundamental stuff of the world and that everything needs to be built out of matter. Uh, now this proposal that information is the fundamental stuff uh, has been out there. I mean, people have explored that and some people have run with it and continue to think, gee, there's something there. But developing this in a way that's, that's cogent, that makes sense, uh, I think that's, that's been a challenge. Being as communion, is a title I came up with when, as I was thinking about what makes things real and it seemed to me that reality is not something that things have in and of themselves but it's something that's conferred in relation to other things. Uh, so the idea there is that things become real because they're related to other things and as a Christian I hold that ultimately things are real because they're related to God. This is actually nothing new in philosophy. I mean, there's uh, the idea of a relational ontology is something that uh, metaphysicians have, have considered. Uh, but where my twist comes, as it were, is then, what, well, what is it that is the glue that relates things? And it is then information. That's why the subtitle of the book is A Metaphysics of Information. So things are real insofar as they exchange information with each other. And information is the primary stuff of the world. Uh, it doesn't mean it's the only stuff of the world. In fact, uh, what I would say is information is ultimately created by intelligence. Uh, but uh, it's the, the outworking of that intelligence happens through information. And that the world is that primarily what happens in the world or the, the fundamental thing that happens in the world is information, the exchange of information, rather than material particles bumping against each other. If you will, material particles bumping against each other becomes an epiphenomenon of information. It's something that's uh, downstream, logically, from the, this more fundamental interplay of information.